makes me happy. Uh, there's quite a list of things that make me happy actually. Um, I like singing and spending time with my friends and family. I love the beach and the memories made on road trips and getting to and from these beaches at various places that I go with my friends. Um, I really love makeup and a mass variety of headbands and cat ears. That's kind of my thing. The, those are the little simple things in life that makes me happy hanging out with friends, family. Keeps me smiling, keeps me going, you know? Uh, I can't really ask for much more than that. Who is Jodie Huntington? Um, well, that's the name that Donna and Keith gave me, mom, dad. Who I became is someone who loves God, who is whimsical and entirely mad and crazy. But as Alice says to the hat in Alice in Wonderland, you're mad bonkers completely off your head, but I'll tell you a secret, all the best people are. Um, suffice to say, I love films and it was my minor at university and it has become something that is very close to my heart. I'm hoping one day that I might work in the industry. Um, hmm. Who is, who am I, who am I, who am I? I'm generally a very happy person and I try not to let outside elements dictate what makes me happy and I do everything to enjoy my life to the fullest. Kind of like most people do, but yeah. That's, that's me. What keeps me going? Frankly, plainly, simply put, um, my want for a future, want for a life after this, after these big changes, that's, that's really what keeps me going, the prospect of having something better and more after this, you know? Is the person I am today greater or lesser than the person I was yesterday? What's my biggest challenge? No. Um, right now, it's essentially starting my life over. And learning to walk again in this in this new body because it's not what I had two years ago but it's essentially learning how to do everything over and I know how to be adjusting myself to the outside world and what they see and how I interpret what they see and how I just try not to let it affect me and grow because if I let it affect me I'll go crazy but yeah that that that's what's happening now what challenges I face and how I'm adjusting to it would I consider myself a fighter uh, yeah yeah I would I would most definitely I have more or less been fighting for my life, really, for more than a year. Besides fighting for my life, I will fight for what I believe in and what I would strive to achieve, which are my goals. Why is it important to fight? Nothing in life is easy, and so we have to fight to get where we want to be, basically. <laughs> Whether it's have anything to do with cancer or just life in general you just have to fight you have to keep on pushing through keep on striving for what you want ah the next big question um what scares me uh what scares me aside from lizards <laughs> i'm generally extremely terrified of failure and ultimately being unhappy in life um as i believe i control my happiness which is why I've worked so hard throughout school and in the workplace to be as far away from from that life filled with failure and unhappiness because that terrifies me. It terrifies me a lot. 